Good morning guys. I'm sitting at my table eating breakfast. I was not planning on doing a day in the life today. Actually, I wanted to, but then I slept terribly last night, like so bad. I don't think I fell asleep till like four. And then Eden woke up at like six. So anyway, I feel like crap and I don't feel like getting ready. So I was like, I don't really wanna do a day in the life when I look really ugly. But then I was watching this girl, her name is Lacey Cheyenne, and I'll link her channel below. And she said that she was gonna do a day in the life, but then she didn't wanna do her makeup, so she wasn't gonna do it. And then she was like, you know what? Real life is like, most people don't wear makeup every day. So she was just gonna keep it real. And I was like, you know what? That's what I'm gonna do. Cause I do try to keep it real. I drink coffee, it's nine, and Eden has already been down for a nap for like an hour. So that's how early she got up. She went down for a nap at eight. It's been quite the morning. Sayla's over there watching cartoons and eating blueberries on the carpet. Oh dear. And I'm just sitting here eating breakfast. I'm eating. Oh crap. And I'm eating this blueberry cheese, blueberry cheddar cheese. Oh, real good. So while I'm sitting here eating breakfast, I'm going to do my Bible reading. So I thought I would just share it with you guys. I've been using the YouVersion app. Just ignore my nasty phone screen. I love this app because you can do like streaks. So my streak is three. Um, <laughs> I need to work on that. It's like um, motivating, I guess. And then they have a verse of the day. So um, it's kind of nice because if I don't have time to like sit down and really dig in, I can just open this up and just see like this verse rejoice in the Lord always and again I say rejoice a little verse can be so like encouraging and uplifting and also if I just see like one verse like it makes me hungry for more you can go to like your different friends and see like what their activity is and see like what they're up to what they're reading what they've highlighted um, and then you can do plans so this is a plan I did it's, it was overcoming fear and anxiety that one was really good and then you can find like other plans that do with like different things you can do it like by topic so like anxiety healing anger hope depression fear peace stress Ooh, let's do that one and um then there's just tons of these different plans so they will have like a little devotional to read and also scripture anyway i just wanted to encourage you in that and if you guys get you version Find me on there and friend me and then we can just encourage each other to read the Bible because there's just so much power in the Word of God. Mommy! Mm. Mm, yeah. Mommy made a mess, huh? It's okay. Oh. What you doing? I'm just gonna play doh You wanna play with play doh What's your favorite color? Purple. Purple is your favorite color? Yeah. No way. Yes, yay. Yes way. Yay. That's a really pretty color. Did you eat all of my toast? <laughs> Good thing I made two, huh? <laughs> all right, so I think two boost my productivity. I want to get something done really quick. A project that I've been trying to get done. <laughs> and that is to go through my clothes and get rid of stuff. Because we're going to be moving in a couple months. Less than a couple months. And I have so much stuff that I don't even wear. I'm gonna, So I'm going to go through my like casual clothes right now. I'm not going to do my like hang up clothes. I'm just going to do this drawer and I'm going to do this thing that's full of pants and leggings and I feel like I'm just going to get rid of like all of them except for my black leggings to be honest and then this oh, I'm so organized you guys it's not even funny this which is sweaters oh, and wait. hoodies and long sleeve shirts a few moments later. Okay, so this is how that drawer looks now. Sorry, this is how that drawer looks now. I have my workout shirts, bathing suit, t-shirts. I have some in the wash that are going to go there. And then some pajamas, but that's a lot better. Over here, 
This is my pants and basically there's some shorts, leggings, a couple pairs of sweatpants, and then some sweaters in here. Oh, they're so bulky. I'm still debating on whether or not I should get rid of some, but I know fall is coming up, so I don't want to like get rid of too much stuff and then I don't have anything to wear, even though I don't really like them that much, but I also don't really have money to buy all new stuff. So um, this is the pile of stuff that I'm getting rid of, which is going to like fill up a trash bag, so that is awesome. And I just need to do this to the whole rest of the house now. All right, you guys, I am on a roll. I still look the same, even though it's like a few hours later, it's 11. And I am selling everything. Like, just doing that, like, one project just, like, made me get into the zone of getting rid of stuff. And so I'm selling everything on Facebook Marketplace. So here I have, like, all these different bags. And these are, like, the different lots of things that I'm selling. Um, and then when people, like, comment on them and say they're, they're going to pick them up, I will just take the bag and write like their name on there, write how much it's going to be, and write like the day and time that they're um, coming. And that just helps me keep everything um, like organized because or else like if I list a bunch of stuff and then I forget like who's coming for what and all that stuff. Um, so I have a lot of experience selling on Facebook Marketplace and buying. I look hideous, but I have no idea what the girls are doing and they're being really quiet. So let's go see what they're doing. What are you doing? Are you allowed to be playing with those? <coughs> yeah, you know what, that's what I wanna do to you. I wanna roar at you for making this mess. Eden, what are you doing? Who made the mess? Oh, you think it's funny? Anyway, I'm literally selling everything. I just put this dresser up for sale, which makes me so sad. I really love it. We are just getting rid of as much as we can because it costs a lot for moving trucks. So we're probably just gonna be using like a small trailer and so we're getting rid of all the like bulky things that we don't necessarily need. And this dresser was so cheap. Like I got it for $15, I think, and then I chalk painted it. So I'm trying to sell it for 40. We'll see if that happens. Anyway, I gotta take a break now because this just sucks. <laughs> like, it feels good to, like, purge, but at the same time, like, it sucks because when you sell stuff, you don't get rid of it, like, right away. <clears throat> you have to, like, hold on to it until people pick it up. So, it's still in here. But at least it's bagged up, and anyway, I need to, like, take care of myself, get myself looking halfway decent, and then clean up this house because, <clears throat> as you can see, the little children are messing it up as I'm getting stuff done. But that's okay, I feel kind of bad. I've been ignoring them, so now I gotta go show them some attention. And myself some attention. So I just went and checked my phone and I already have two people that wanna buy the dresser and I just put it up like a second before I turn the camera on, so. Yay, apparently $40 is a good deal. Are you gonna sell your dresser? So I really need to get a car mount for my camera. That would be so helpful. Anyway, so right after I got done talking to you guys in the last clip, my husband texted me and was wondering if I wanted to meet him at a food truck for lunch. Um, duh. So, that's where we're going. I slept on some makeup in two seconds, threw my hair up. And we're gonna go get some food truck food. So we'll see you guys there. Starbucks because I'm literally dying. But you guys know how that feels. 
you don't get sleep and you're just like in a fog and you feel like sick that's how I feel so I'm like treating myself this is bad I feel kind of guilty but I don't know hopefully it'll help me get some more stuff done although I kind of want to take a nap when the girls take a nap hopefully they'll still take a nap when we go home what should I get I feel like I'm gonna get some sort of frappuccino because I want to get something like super fancy just because it'll make me feel better. <laughs> Hi, can I get a grande java chip frappuccino with raspberry, please? Grande java chip frappuccino add raspberry. Anything else for you? No, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. <laughs> I feel like this whole vlog is just going to be like me talking, so I'm so sorry. They're not all like this, but <sighs> okay, so here's the deal. I came home to put the girls to bed. They would not go back to sleep because they slept for like 20 minutes in the car. So that really sucked because I literally like laid on the couch, got wrapped up in a blanket, was so excited to take a nap. <laughs> and that didn't happen. I was planning on like sleeping for a little bit of their nap time and then cleaning. And yeah, so that didn't happen. So what I did was I put them in Sailor's crib. I turned the light on for them and I gave them a bunch of books and I said they need to have quiet time because I just needed time where they're not like around to clean like crazy because they're like I don't know what it is about today I think it's just because I'm like distracted and not like um I'm not really playing with them because I'm you know organizing and getting rid of stuff so they're just doing everything like that they're not supposed to do and making like the hugest like most horrible messes trying not to like lose my cool because like I understand they're not getting attention and so I feel you know whatever so anyway yeah so that's what I'm doing now I'm cleaning like cry cry a few moments later Love, look at the two oh. okay, your finger stranger in every way Wow, mommy dizzy. You dizzy? Wow. <laughs> you got Dwight Shrew here. Are you Dwight Shrew? Say please. Please. Naked please. girl. Please. Eden, say please. Good girl. Can you count to ten? Yeah. Okay, do it. One, two, three, seven, eight, nine. Wow, good job.